Super long intro, but kind of cool. This is some super hyperspace crazy technology. Check this out. Be sure and subscribe if you haven't. Is that Jared? That is the comma two. What is the comma two? The comma two. Well, the uh, comma two makes the Open Pilot, which is a third-party autopilot for or third-party yeah third-party autopilot for an airplane. For, uh, nope, for a car. What? So we're gonna play with that today, and just got it. What kind of cars does it go in? It goes in. Well, they have. Uh, they have a lot of cars that they support, but um, really they do have a list of supported cars. But uh, it does any, basically anyone that does the uh, lane departure assist where it has the servos to Sweet. turn the wheel. So we'll put a link to their website down in the description. You ought to check that out. Let's open this beast, see how it works. Okay. Meanwhile, while he's doing that, I got my Diet Mountain Dew. So what we are going to do is we're going to put this in a Hyundai Sonata, 2020 Sonata. That's what we're going to do. Nice. And then we're going to drive it from Afton, Wyoming to Pocatello, Idaho by just kind of just watching it. <laughs> if we'll if we that. dare. So no, no. Welcome, Welcome to, to the fleet. fleet. So open source is uh, where they take data from the way your car performs with it to improve it. Is that right? Yep. And uh, yes, yeah, so we're going to download the software here onto it because it doesn't have anything. So it says visit comma.ai slash setup for step-by-step -step instructions and claim your free comma prime offer in the comma connect app. Nice. So here's the uh, unit right here. Oh, it comes with a uh, phone base. Is that a phone? It is a phone, basically. That is it's awesome. built into this uh, holder. And uh, I believe it has, I'm not sure exactly which one's which or what, but I know they have forward facing camera that monitors the driver's face to make sure they're paying attention. Nice. And 
We're gonna test that for yeah, sure to that, see so. if it shuts off or does whatever it's supposed to do when you start snoozing. Yeah. Then on the back has a, a camera there that's gonna monitor the road that's and then your power. That and is so cool. Yeah. That's so the whole thing? That's Maybe that's some it. wires? Yeah, some wires that probably. so awesome. And so we'll see what else we got here. Wow. All right, and then Super it has cool. the, uh, and then I bought with it the Hyundai uh, connector cord. This is gonna be fun. So those are, uh, looks like two different mounts for the uh, oh, device. Okay. So you mount it straight to the windshield. Yep, okay. straight to the windshield. Cool. Hide your and address there. That's right. And then it looks like we have a power cord, which is, looks like USB-C. Perfect. And then it has a, uh, uh, this is the harness that will plug into the, um, into the car near the mirror, uh, the rear view mirror. It's going to plug in, and I believe that uses some of the existing parts of the car. And then it has a basically a Ethernet cable, and then that goes all the way down to the what is it? OB, OBD2. OBD2 plug. And so we're going to plug that in down there for that. So this uh, takes a little bit of a procedure to open up the car to where we can plug this. Oh, you know what? So there, that plugs in there. This plugs in here. Yeah, yeah. So we'll have a cord that goes from so, that into the uh, casing near the mirror. So this doesn't mount by the mirror, does it? It does. This mount, we'll just mount it right underneath the uh, rear view mirror. So, so this, oh, I see. I, th I was thinking yeah. side mirror. This is the rear view rear mirror view in mirror, that yeah. fancy car. Yep, yeah. rear gotcha. view mirror. So, and it's going to face towards the driver there and then this will be up in the control box basically above cool. the rear mirror and this cord will go from here to there so do we need to charge that and install stuff first or so we do need to turn it on and download software so and so this whole this whole thing was um twelve hundred dollars so the uh the uh, monitor here was in uh, a thousand and then the harness for the Hyundai was 200 So $200 is what, what that costs. So. Okay, we're going to figure out how to turn this thing on and we'll do the install. And then we'll go do some driving. That sweet red Hyundai. Hey guys, thanks for watching. So I'm at home editing the video. This little open pilot deal is super, super cool. Um, of course, you got to have the right kind of car that it will work on. Uh, I don't have one of those, but we've got a bunch of video I'll be editing. Probably have two or three in the like a series or something, but uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Please share. Check it out. If you have a car that has that lane departure control, thing's only 1200 bucks, and it really fine-tuned it. We were a couple corners, you know, gradual corners, but we were going 70 and the normal lane control couldn't handle it, but this open pilot just nailed it. It's absolutely awesome. Might get me into buying a new car, I doubt it, because I'm cheap, but super cool. Thanks for watching.